you may have to replace the strap on your boat trailer winch like mine it broke I'm going to show you exactly how to do that right now it's simple and easy so what happened over time is my strap here frayed and it finally broke so I was just putting my boat in the water and I didn't want to go home and have to fix this. I still wanted to go boating. So so your strap may have frayed and it finally snapped like mine. As you can see, this is old. The sun's been beating on it. So that's what happened. It let go. So we're going to replace it. Now I've already removed the strap from my wrench, but really all it is, is there's a bolt going through here with a nut. Now you may have to line up your, uh, your gear here, your wheel, so that you can access it and get the get a wrench on it. But you just take that out and your old strap will come out. So we'll get rid of that and we're gonna put on a new one. So what I did is I picked up a new strap and it was only like $20. And now as you can see, brand new, this is made wrong. See there's a there's a loop in it like this. It's made wrong. I can't even straighten this out. But that's all right. It's going to do its job anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run it through here. And I'll bring you in and show you that. So you want to bring it through here because it's going to go, your strap is going to go under here and ride on this spool, this bushing. And it's going to hook onto the front of your boat right there. So we'll put the new strap in here. And now I'm going to run this bolt through. And we're going to run it through this loop here. Now the reason I'm doing this video and showing you this is because I've seen someone else do this and they did it totally wrong. They ran the strap through these uh, one of these holes and then ran the bolt through after you flatten out the strap in here. And you shouldn't be running the strap through these bolts at all. All you need to do is run it flat through here, run the bolt through the loop. And I'm going to put the nut side on the gear side. You see the gears here? Then I'll take two wrenches that fit the bolt and the nut and we'll tighten it up. Okay, so the bolt is tight now, and it's through the strap loop, and we're just going to wind it up now. And you want to keep some tension on the strap over here so that when you're winding up your winch, the strap will stay nice and snug in there as you turn. So now it's all the way, now I'm going to hook the strap with the hook onto the boat. And so thank you for watching, I hope this video helped you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, leave a comment below, and we'll see you on the next video. Take care.